morning. It's Sunday morning, April 14th. Don't get all excited. I only know that because tomorrow's tax day. <laughs> it is, I don't know what time it is. What time is it? It's still morning. 10.09. Um, we've been up for a while. We did sleep in a little bit, which is cool. Loving the new bed, by the way, has helped my husband snoring tremendously. Um, and mine too, I think. Anyway, I was doing a little cleaning and sorting just upstairs just now. As you can hear, my husband's got laundry going in the background. Um, kids are coming over to watch Game of Thrones later. And I think Bambi, Bambi might be outside eating breakfast. Let's go see if we can take a peek. Bambi is eating breakfast. So. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Good morning. It's Monday morning, April 15th, tax day. It is 9.55 a.m. Don't get excited. Hello, computer. Um, I have been doing the social media thing and making phone call, business phone calls. Um, not about art business, personal stuff. Nothing bad. All good. Um, but, you know, my husband left for work and said, can you do this and can you? So I did, you know. Uh, what else? I have contractors coming over for more estimates today. And I need to do some cleaning and reorganization in the art room. And I need to film a couple of quick videos and get them edited. And I need to download last week's vlog clips and get that edited. All I really want to do is sit down and read a book. <laughs> but there's a lot of other stuff to do. I do have a few minutes before contractors come for estimates, so I may get a little bit of reading in, and then after they're gone, do the filming and cleaning in the art room. Yeah, that might be how it plays out today. We'll see. All right, I'll be back. When you have appointments and things sporadically during the day, I don't know about you guys, but it's just hard to get anything else done. You're busy waiting on people, calling people, I, yeah, <laughs> it's just a thing. I haven't got any of the filming done I wanted to do today, but they're both short videos. I do have a little bit, so I think I'm gonna go upstairs and try to get them done. I'm gonna show you all a couple things before I film the videos. I got some stuff in, so A hang couple on. of new um, doodle designs on black paper. You can get them as digital downloads and stickers and things from my Etsy shop. But you can also get it on fabric from Spoonflower. This is a cotton fabric. Um, you can also get it on merch like leggings over at Teespring. So I will connect um, all of those in the description below. I got Spoonflower prints on lots of different kinds of fabric, including a knit. And I think I might try to make myself a shirt. I hesitate to say that because I haven't done any garment sewing in a long time, but it's pretty cool. Anyway, I am going to do some sorting and cleaning now and try to get those videos filmed. I'll be back. Hey guys, so uh, a few weeks ago, we, I think about two weeks, I announced um, with um, the design team inchy challenge that I had four extra inches. I was going to wrap up and giveaway we were going to have a giveaway here on the channel and um, the time period for that ended today so we are going to pick four winners and I'm gonna at the very least send you an inchy probably I'm gonna send you a little bit more than that it's not gonna be a big package it will be an envelope like a greeting card size envelope but there'll probably be other stuff in there just FYI all right let's pick some winners shall we The first winner is Rosalind Jones. Rosalind, I need your address. I will be emailing y'all. If you don't get the email um, before you see this, then um, check your spam folder. Um, so that's one. Rosalind is one. Let's add another one. Pat O'Donnell Kun. Kun? K-U-H-N. Pat, I probably pronounced that wrong. I'm sorry. 
Uh, but Pat, um, you're another winner. Woohoo! I'll be emailing you along with Rosalind. Let's see, one more. Aaron Petty. Reminds me of Tom Petty. <laughs> um, Aaron, uh, I, you're another winner. So, woohoo! Um, that one's going to Canada. Holy crud. United States. Australia. Rosalind and Pat, uh, Rosalind and Aaron, I don't know how long it's going to take to get yours or how long, how much it's going to cost. You're going to get it anyway. I didn't put any limitations on that, but it might take a little while. I'll try to let you all know when they leave here. Okay, one more winner. It's thinking. I think it's thinking. Oh, here, wait. Really? refresh and try that again shall we it doesn't want to pick another one there we go Judy Steins Judy you are another winner I'm going to email all of you right now and so get me your addresses and it is Monday right now but I will try to get your envelopes out in the mail to you um, no later than Saturday uh, that gives me the week to get them done there is a lot of stuff going on this week but um, I'll get your inchies on the way to you and you know, a little other little goodie. Uh, we'll see what I could put in there without making the envelopes too heavy since two of them are going uh, out of the country. Um, and that's it for the moment. I hope you all have a great evening. I will be back tomorrow. Bye, guys. I'll be right back tomorrow. Morning. It's Tuesday morning. Um, April 16th. I only know that because yesterday was tax day. It's just after 9 a.m. I don't know exactly what time it is. <laughs> Big surprise. Um, we are obviously out here in the garage. Um, I think a neighbor's having their carpets cleaned or something. Anyway, uh, I am going to check on Bambi's bowls and feed Bambi, and then I'm gonna go out and run a couple errands. I probably don't need to run today, but I just, you know, it's good to get out of the house a little bit rather than being stuck in the house all day. So anyway. I will be Sometimes back. it's just the little things, right? I can always tell when my husband's been driving my car. My feet so totally don't reach the pedals. He's so much taller than me. And he never remembers to put the seat back. <laughs> it's the little things some days, right? Anyway, all right, I'll be back. Bambi hasn't been by to eat their breakfast yet. That's okay. So when I was out at the store today, I forgot about something. I have a few things in life and the environment that set off my asthma. They're givens. Pine tree pollen. Yes, I know. I do have a stock of allergy pills and inhalers. <laughs> um, cigarette smoke, perfume or cologne, and cinnamon pine cones. For whatever reason, those cinnamon scented pine cones at Christmas time drive me crazy. I start coughing. Uh, with all of them, I start coughing. If I don't control the coughing, then I start wheezing. And if I don't control the wheezing, then I can't breathe and I'm suffocating or I feel like I am. So, yeah, asthma. Hello, welcome to my world. I forgot about Easter lilies. Holy moly. <laughs> Walked into Fred Meyer and the whole front entryway was covered in Easter lilies. Had to hold my breath going in and out. That was fun. Not. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna check the mail, then I'm gonna go sit down and have something to eat because I haven't eaten yet today and I'm a little hungry. Good. I was gonna say morning, but it's not morning. It's three o'clock. Good afternoon. <laughs> it's Wednesday, May, uh, May. April. 17th, I think. Um, I've been busy all morning. Making phone calls, editing video, fixing my link tree list of links, updating the Teespring merch site, which is connected to YouTube. <sighs> yeah. Re-editing video, because I didn't do it right the first time. Yeah, that's a thing. Anyway, I, um, 
I'm a little out of breath. Okay, so I have a meeting um, at five o'clock that I have to be to, and I need to go pick up some sort of aerosol sealer spray, probably Krylon matte finish spray, and because of for an upcoming video and project. I don't use it a lot. I have asthma, so I don't use aerosols a lot, and when I do, I wear a mask. But that being said, for the project I'm going to be doing, it's really the best option. So I'll probably stop by Michael's with a coupon on my way. Yes, I have makeup on a little bit because, you know, it is a meeting. Um, I was chatting with Cindy and my friend Vicki Brown, Cindy Utter and Vicki Brown, while I was editing today and answering emails and doing social media things and editing the video and did I say that already? Anyway, um, those two are hilarious, but they are not good for um, chatting to while you're edit while you're editing. And you shouldn't probably be chatting with your friends while you're editing video anyway. Yeah, you should probably have the computer be quiet because <laughs> then you don't make mistakes and have to re-edit things. So that was the thing. My fault, not theirs. Uh, anyway, got it fixed. And um, had some emails I had to answer from DecoArt and had to send them some links. And I'm waiting for the last video to finish uploading. I have nine minutes and then I can head out to go pick up the spray and maybe run one or two errands before I go to the meeting. I think that's how the day is gonna play out. <sighs> yeah, so anyway. I should check on Bambi's food bowls too before I leave. Um, they probably need corn would be my guess. So I'm gonna just diddle around for eight, minute, eight minutes now until this is done. And then I'm gonna, even though it's only just after three o'clock, I'm gonna, once this is finished, I'm gonna shut off my computer for the day. So by the time I get home, I'm not gonna wanna go on the computer. So I'm gonna just turn it off and be done with it up here for the day and then hit the art studio fresh tomorrow. Hopefully I can get that spray and then I can start filming um, that video. And I have commitment videos to do for May, I almost said April. I have to do the My Creative Year videos, Explorations of Me, something for the Design Team Challenge, and that's it. There's some things on here I need to cross off. I've done already. So I need to do a few more videos. I'm hoping to do them uh, between now and next week. Um, because I think that would be a good idea. And then I'm done. And then I can start working on June. So it's a plan anyway. That's it for the moment. I'll be back. So really quick, this is interesting. In California, all of these aerosol cans be behind a locked case. In Oregon, not so much. That's different. Something else that's different. Look at all this over open stock pens, markers, pencils. You would never see that in the California Michael store. Hmm. So that was different. Uh, I didn't really have permission to film in Michaels, so I wasn't. Tr I was trying not to talk, talk, trying not to speak too loudly. But you know, I'm used to stores in California, and I don't know about where you all live. Uh, Michaels stores in particular, the one I worked at. Uh, in San Jose, um, all of the spray cans were always under lock and key. All, we, all of the open stock pencils and pens, for the most part, I think with the exception of Sharpie, um, were usually under lock and key. Um, they just don't do some of those things here like they do in California. I don't, that's different. I'm not used to that. So I expected to have to go in there and then wait for somebody to come unlock the case and then get the matte finish spray and you know blah 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 so 
I did get one little pack of stencils I don't really need because hello I design stencils I have a large collection of stencils but I couldn't resist it has little cactuses on it it's so cute um, I'll do a share um, tomorrow I won't have one to do a uh, time to do one today so I'll do one tomorrow so anyway I am uh, gonna use the navigation app to see how long it's going to take to get to the meeting place and um, I think I might be early because I expected Michael's to take longer but that's okay I do have a iPad with me I can just read a book so would be the first time I was massively early for a meeting because you know I'd rather be early than late yeah that's a thing I'll be back it's Thursday morning April 18th, 9.02 a.m. Don't get excited. Hello, computer. Um, I am obviously upstairs in the art room and um, just finished all of my stuff for social media. I wanted to show you my little small haul at Michael's yesterday. I needed some matte finish spray. Aerosol sprays aren't things, something I use a lot of. They're not great for the environment. They suck for my asthma, but for the project I'm gonna be working on for YouTube, this is the best product for the job. So yeah, that's the thing. I got some, a big package of these little small, um, sort of little paint containers for another project. And then the one thing I didn't need, but I got anyway, hello, I design stencils and I have a large collection See the rack behind me? There you go. Um, but I have found these. This pack has all of those designs in it right there. It was pretty inexpensive. I think it was like $5.99 or something. It's got eight stencils in it and I had a coupon. So yeah, didn't really need it, but there you go. I need to go downstairs now that I'm finished with the social media thing. I've had my coffee. I've had my breakfast. I've checked email and all that. Um, I need to go downstairs and feed Bambi, sort some laundry, start a load, and then I need to go to the grocery store. I need to get ham and stuff for Easter dinner Sunday. So, yep, I'll be back. Ever have those moments when you get down this block and you don't remember if you've closed the garage door or not? And there's a neighbor who happens to be outside sweeping his sidewalk. He just sees you going up and down the street a couple of times and it probably is looking at you like you're nuts. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> Holy cow. Is it still morning? No. It's 12.01 p.m. Lunchtime. That might explain why I'm hungry. Hello, everybody. It is Friday, April 19th. Yesterday was my mom's birthday, and I forgot to call her. Oops. Uh-oh. <laughs> or send her a card or anything. That's not very good. So, I guess I know what I'm doing when I hang up the phone. <laughs> um, we are seeing them in a couple of weeks, so we'll probably wait to get her anything and bring her something then. Anyway. Um been working on paperwork and the computer and stuff all day doing social media getting ready uh, with the contractor that we picked to have the outside of the house painted and some electrical work done um, working on patreon i uploaded a bunch of videos to patreon um, some all are available to patrons some are available to patrons only of a certain monetary level but they're all over there and I'm going to um, put some uh, digital artwork shares over there. I do that once a month. So um, we're uh, headed into May. I think I did April's already, but I have to check and see because I lost track a little bit. Um, but I'm going to wait to download anything over there uh, for a little bit and have some lunch. And um, yeah, so that's a thing. I got a couple of patterns drafted, altered or cut out, sewing patterns. I know, right? Um, I w one is one that I drafted from a shirt that I already own, and one is a store-bought one that I altered from actually this shirt that I'm wearing. 
Um, I haven't cut the fabric out yet, but I did get the pattern part done, which was a big project, so I got that done this morning. I think we're going to um, go out to dinner later, and uh, yeah, not much else. I'm just, we're just kind of taking it easy, quiet day here around the house. I'm do working on laundry, always, always laundry. Um, after lunch, I'll go check Bambi's bowls. They were full this morning, and... I have some art journaling and stuff to do and a video to edit, so I'll be working on that too. That's it for the moment. I'll be back. Saturday morning, April something, 20th I think. It's 9.39 a.m. I know that because I'm in the car, but I haven't checked to see what the date is yet. I think it's the 20th or 21st. I don't, I honestly don't know. It's, I know it's Saturday. <laughs> um, anyway. Okay, the giveaways are in the mail the three and I'm going to now head to the grocery outlet and see if I can get some Ziploc bags. All right, wish me luck. Stuck in traffic for what must be the Pacific Northwest's largest train. Cargo train? Is that what you call it with all the box car box, box, box train, box car train. Yeah. yeah. We've been sitting here, what, 10 minutes? 10 minutes, 10 minutes at least. And yeah. it's still coming. It's still going. With no end in sight. Oh joy. It is late. Night. Late. It's 1030. Saturday, April 20th at 1030. Yes, it took me until 1030 at night to realize what the actual date was. Because, yes, I didn't know what the, it was this morning. Mm -hmm. Oops. We had an interesting afternoon of picking up pieces and parts and shopping for stuff that we needed for the house and 
Then we came home and just didn't want to do anything. So we didn't. Nope. We had a nice dinner of some baked salmon that Fred made. Fred made salmon. Fred made salmon and salad and crescent rolls. Mm -hmm. it, was, it was very good. And tomorrow the kids are coming over for dinner. It's Easter. So we hope you all have had a good week and that you have a happy Easter. Um, if you um, want to support the free content here on YouTube and over on Facebook, check out my link tree full of links. Um, you can find my Etsy shop, my Amazon store, Patreon, and a whole bunch of other stuff, along with places to follow me on social media like Instagram and Twitter. Um, my happy mail address is down there, too. Fred and I like happy mail, so, you know. Uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that little bell icon for uh, notifications of new videos when they come out. And um, the most important thing, of course, is to go out and have a great day. Have a great week. Have a happy Easter. And a happy Passover. And a happy Passover. And don't forget to do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. We'll see you later. Bye, guys. Thank you.